Welcome to Spaceverse, your portal to cosmic adventures. In a momentous announcement that could redefine humanity's place in the universe, NASA has revealed the detection of the first alien signal coming from Proxima b, the closest known exoplanet to Earth, just over four light-years away within the habitable zone of its star, Proxima Centauri. This discovery has stirred excitement and curiosity across the globe, prompting the question, could this be the moment we realize we are not alone? This discovery was made possible by NASA's powerful telescopes, which have been meticulously observing distant stars and planets in the quest for evidence of extraterrestrial life. Due to its Earth-like qualities and proximity to our solar system, Proxima b has always been a strong candidate for finding intelligent life. The detected signal stands out with its unique and structured pattern, something astronomers have never seen before, potentially marking a historic turning point for humanity. The significance of this finding is profound. Not only does it bolster the belief that life could thrive under similar conditions to those on Earth, but it also raises the question of what kind of civilization might be behind the signal. Are we looking at microorganisms, or could there be advanced beings capable of interstellar communication and travel? This signal is not just random noise or a natural cosmic occurrence, but it contains a repeating structure indicating an intelligent source. NASA scientists, along with international experts, are now working to decode the message, trying to uncover its meaning and purpose. The global scientific community is filled with speculation about the message's contents. Could it be a greeting, a warning, guidance, or something entirely beyond our understanding? The news of this discovery has spread beyond the scientific community, igniting conversations on social media, in government chambers, and around dinner tables worldwide. People are now looking at the stars with renewed wonder, imagining beings on a distant world who might be doing the same. How alike or different might their world be to ours? What could their society, technology, and culture be like? The possibilities are as limitless as the universe itself. This discovery also raises a host of ethical and existential questions. How should humanity respond if the signal's originators are truly trying to communicate? What protocol should be established for interstellar diplomacy? And perhaps most importantly, how would such a discovery alter our understanding of life, religion, and our identity as humans? Amid the excitement, caution remains crucial. NASA, along with other space agencies, is working meticulously to validate the findings, ensuring the signal is not a false alarm or misinterpretation. As we stand at the edge of what could be the most significant discovery in human history, the next steps must be taken with great care and responsibility. As the world waits anxiously for further analysis, the detection of an alien signal from Proxima b not only pushes our scientific efforts into a new frontier, but also brings us together with a shared sense of curiosity and hope that we may soon find the answer to one of humanity's oldest and deepest questions. Are we alone in the universe? In April 2019, a radio signal was detected coming from deep space. Its origin was identified as the Proxima Centauri region, located 4.37 light-years away. While this distance may seem significant, the next nearest star is three times farther. The third brightest star in our sky belongs to a triple star system, which includes the binary pair Alpha Centauri A and B, as well as Alpha Centauri C, also known as Proxima Centauri. Alpha Centauri A and B are close stellar companions, both similar to the Sun, Alpha Centauri A emits a yellow light and is 1.5 times brighter than the Sun, while Alpha Centauri B shines with an orange way and is half as bright. In size, Alpha Centauri A is slightly larger and Alpha Centauri B is smaller, making the Sun's size fall between them. The pair is also older, with an age of approximately 5 billion years. But from which of these stars did the signal come, and what could have caused it? The signal, called Breakthrough Listen Candidate 1, was discovered by the Breakthrough Listen Project. This initiative was established to search for extraterrestrial communication from intelligent life and has received about $100 million in funding. The project has used thousands of hours of telescope time and cutting-edge technology to achieve its goal. The CSIRO Parks Radio Telescope in New South Wales, Australia, detected the signal during its observation of Proxima Centauri, the closest star to the Sun. The signal almost went unnoticed amid the vast data gathered over thousands of hours, but scientists managed to identify it like finding a needle in a haystack. To be considered a legitimate candidate, the signal had to meet two criteria. 
first, it needed to be limited to a narrow frequency range, like a radio signal, something very unusual, as there are no known natural mechanisms in space capable of producing such a signal. The second requirement was that the frequency must change in line with the relative motion of the exoplanet to Earth. Scientists had to analyze nearly 4 million signals detected by the telescope in Australia. After extensive filtering and eliminating unnecessary signals, they were left with 5,000 distinct candidates. Among them, one stood out, a signal that could not be explained even after cross-referencing with modern terrestrial radio transmissions. It was a unique techno-signature that appeared only when the telescope was pointed at Proxima Centauri and persisted for a 30-hour observation period. Upon further investigation, the source of the signal was identified as Proxima b, an exoplanet discovered by astronomers in 2016 using the radial velocity method. A star does not remain completely stationary when being orbited by planets. Due to the gravitational pull from orbiting planets, the star moves in a slight wobble. Researchers use extremely sensitive spectrographs to monitor the light spectrum from the star. When a planet pulls the star closer, its light appears slightly blue-shifted, while it appears slightly red-shifted when moving away. When these shifts occur at consistent intervals over days, months, or years, it confirms that the motion is due to the gravitational influence of an orbiting planet. Closer examination reveals that Proxima b is quite similar to Earth. The exoplanet appears to have a radius of 1.1 times that of Earth and a mass 1.3 times greater, with a similar density. It is also a rocky planet. However, there are differences. One major difference is the relative location of the two planets within their respective solar systems. Proxima b is much closer to its parent star, just 0.05 astronomical units away, whereas even Mercury, the closest planet to our Sun, is 0.4 astronomical units away. Despite being so close, Proxima b isn't scorched like Mercury because Proxima Centauri is a faint red dwarf providing only 60% of the energy that Earth receives from the Sun. This puts Proxima b in the habitable zone, meaning conditions may support the possibility of life. There are countless unknown planets scattered across our universe. So far, we have discovered an impressive 4,935 exoplanets, with a recent addition of 65 new planets bringing the total to 5,000. These 65 exoplanets were officially added to the NASA Exoplanet Archive on March 21st of this year, marking a significant milestone. The James Webb Space Telescope, the most advanced telescope ever built, is 100 times more powerful than its predecessor, allowing us to uncover the mysteries of the vast cosmos. In the past, we've discovered a wide variety of planets, from small rocky worlds to gas giants larger than Jupiter, as well as extremely hot, uninhabitable planets. Among them, some stand out, like Kepler 1649c. Its characteristics are strikingly similar to Earth, making it the most habitable planet we've identified that could potentially harbor life. So far, we've found 55 of these Earth-like planets, though we haven't yet studied them all in detail. With rapid advancements in technology, especially thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope, who knows what we may discover in the future? Finding a planet capable of sustaining life would be incredible. One of the key goals for the Webb Telescope during its first year of missions is to locate and study extraterrestrial planets beyond our solar system, with a focus on their formation as well as the potential for water and biological life. Webb's research on star and planet formation helps connect studies of mature exoplanets with their birth conditions, and it offers insights into the origins of our own solar system. Webb's infrared capabilities are perfect for revealing star and planet formation for three main reasons. Infrared light penetrates dust effectively, detects the thermal signatures of young stars and planets, and reveals key chemical components like water and organic molecules. Mid-infrared light can pass through clouds up to 20 times thicker than visible light. This is crucial for observing young stars still hidden within their natal clouds, where visible light cannot penetrate. The infrared capabilities of Webb are critical for examining the early stages of star formation when gas and dust are collapsing inward to form new stars. There's more to natal star clouds, though. Both young stars and giant planets begin as massive, puffy structures that gradually shrink over time. As young stars age, they grow hotter while giant planets cool down, but both emit more infrared than visible light. 
This means Webb is particularly well-suited to finding new stars and planets, and will significantly improve our understanding of the physics behind their formation. The MIRI instrument on Webb will also search for heated molecular gas near young stars, which may indicate the formation of rocky planets that could be habitable. It's no surprise that much of Webb's initial scientific work focuses on understanding how planetary systems develop the molecules that are essential for life as we know it. And that's it. Thanks for exploring the universe with us on Spaceverse. From the intriguing signal from Proxima b to the groundbreaking discoveries of the James Webb Space Telescope, we're on the edge of redefining life beyond Earth. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more cosmic adventures. Until next time, keep looking up.